Okay, this is the Spice Road table here at um, the Morocco Pavilion Epcot. And I'm going to go on there and um, do a little food review for you guys and show you. I want to eat here forever. Look at that cool sign. This might be one of those restaurants around their way out, I'm not sure. This Disney's going to stop taking reservations for them December or something. I don't remember the date. So I want to make sure I get here. This has been one of my top wanted places for a while. All right, let's get to it. Here's, here's the menu, guys, an actual paper menu, which a lot of places haven't been having. These beverages. And of course, I'll go over what we get. Pretty cool. Now you could sit, have seen outside, and they have seating like where at inside. I asked for the inside because it's hot out there, and I wanted to see what this place looked like because I've never been in here. Looks pretty cool, huh? And they got tables and booths. Pretty coolly decorated, huh? So yeah. They like one of those water mill things that go around out there. I'll try to show you later. And then one friendship ship, that's where it docks. How are you doing today? So I, what, do you, what do you think of this place so far? Oh, yeah, it's got its culture to it. Yes. Yes. So what do you think about getting? Oh, I'm gonna get the, the Mediterranean vegetable platter. Which is right here, guys. Because I like hummus. And I think I'm gonna get the three lamb sliders. And then we're gonna get from the small plates the hummus and imported olives. Oh, okay. And then I really want to try this iced mint tea. I think that's going to be good. And when it comes in, we'll show you guys. Yep. I just want to point out this table, guys. Look how cool that looks. Like, yeah. like a metal sheeting over it. Yeah. It looks like it's gold. Pretty classy looking. I like it. Yeah. Oh, this is what the water looks like that he brought us. Of course, these are the napkins with the silverware. Now right, here's the ice mint tea. They have regular tea, then they have ice mint tea. So I thought I'd try the ice mint tea. This would be different. Here it goes. Yeah. It's basically like a peppermint or mint. All right, here's the hummus and imported olives. And here's the special bread that comes with it. I just gotta take a picture, guys, and then I'll um, try some on camera. All right, quite excited. This I've seen someone else try this on camera. It looks really good. Looks a little different from what I remember, but I thought, you know what? I have to get in and try it. There it is. Okay, let me switch you around. Just, just gotta put you here. They give you a little plate too. Good. Hopefully I can get this. Oop, you guys are a little crooked. Perfect. First, safety first. Gotta have lots of hand sanitizer. Okay. Let's try the hummus first. I forget what kind of um, bread they call this, but I showed it in the description. Yep. Not pita, it's um... Is this is this, this, this tan or something like that? If you get a chance to check it out, here we try some of the hummus. Yeah. The, is this hard or something? Yeah. 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 Pan, sugar, mm. fried pita chip. Very good. I actually really like hummus. That's good quality. It, it's definitely not cheap stuff. Very savory, definitely. Let's try some of these olives. You have green and you have black. Oh. 
Very strong tasting, but nice. Salty, but not hugely salty. Normally, salty, um, cheaper olives are a lot more saltier. This isn't too bad. Let's try one of these pickles. Um, those aren't normal dill pickles. Those are um, pickled differently. It's very um, very vinegary, but very good. I'm not sure if the other hummus is different. It is different. Yes. That one's more plainer, but good. I actually like that one better. The other one has like a little bit of a red stuff mixed in. I think it's a little bit spicier, but very good. Very nice. Expensive, but I'm very happy to be here. This is rumored that this restaurant might not survive, because I heard that Disney took over this pavilion, and they're gonna stop taking reservations for this restaurant restaurant sometime in December. So what that means is might be on the chopping block too. I hope not. I should have been wanting to come here for years. Actually, I had a drink with a friend. Uh, well, we got a drink here and then we sat across at the other place. Like 2017, ever since then I've been wanting to eat here. So I'm very happy I got here. I'm very excited. All right, this, next we'll be on to the main plate. The um, hummus and olives have been amazing. The ice mint tea is pretty good too. Can't wait to get on to the next thing. All right, see you, bye. See you in a minute, actually. What do you think so far? I love hummus. This is good. Real good. This isn't a, this isn't a huge place, guys, but there's a decent amount of seating. But remember, this is the seating inside and then the seating out there. Oh, they do have their own bathroom right there. Just to let you know. Don't forget to always look up. There's always lots of cool decorations. So seating here. Then out there, past the bar, the seating outside. Okay, here's the the Medi well, Mediterranean vegetable plate. Yep. That's the hummus fries. Yep. So the different stuff she, she has. Those are great leaves or something. Yeah. Cook, cousin. Couscous. Couscous. And this is about what we had for the. Yeah, for the um, appetizer. Yes. Here's the three lamb sliders with the sauce. Because I think it was like tzatziki, but I'll make sure in the description. There's the hummus fries, which we'll see how those goes. I had hummus fries before and I never actually quite liked them. But look at that, it looks nice. Yeah. Thank you. Awesome, thank you. Alright, go ahead and try yours. Okay, here we go. I'm gonna try this because I haven't had oh they're cold. The raisin. I don't know what this is. You gotta try one, Michael. I'll try one. Mm. Here, friend. That was fries. Oh, how much fries? Yeah, like a taco. No, wait. Cool, cool. This is all cool. How about this? Oh, about the hummus fries, huh? How about this? This probably, is what we ate. That's probably how it's served. Yeah, the same, exact same thing. Well, I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to put my lemon whoop, on this. Ah, the way I eat my sushi. Okay. Okay. Very good. Okay, so now let me try mine. Ooh, I and, like And I'll go over the menu again, exactly what we got. Different. Alright. First, let's do the hummus fries. Let's see. Mm. Weird texture. It's, um, it's like very gritty. Yeah, gritty and gushy inside. The outside is like a hard, crispy shell. It's weird. Let's try a little bit of that sauce on this. Can you bring your straw? 
I think he forgot, but that's okay. That sauce is a lot better with it. Spicy. Let's take a look at the um, lamb sliders, guys. Ooh. Has olives on it. Okay. Now, let's try one on camera. Nice little slider, little hamburger. No? Yeah, that's it, onions inside that. It's actually very good. I've had lamb before, and it's usually. I've always found lamb to be kind of greasy and tough. But this isn't, this is um, cooked very well. You know you're not eating beef. It is, the texture is a little different and the taste is different. It has a certain spice in the background of it. Almost like maybe basil or fennel. Yeah, taste it. Try another one. It's not really greasy at all. Like I said, the texture is different. Biting through this and say, a hamburger made out of beef, it just feels different. This is very, very good. I never had anything quite like it. Never had a basically lamb hamburger. Very nice. I'm gonna try some of hers. Think of that. That's the raisin. Oh. Different. Um. <laughs> That's weird. Uh huh. I'm not sure if I really like it. It's like. Getting like a soft cheese almost. It has a grape, almost like a tea taste to it. Like a black tea taste to it. It's very weird. Everything okay? Yeah, everything's great. Thank you. I want to try some of that stuff. Try this. I'm gonna let me try this. Try that. Here's some, I think, couscous in the middle. That's not bad. It's okay. I wouldn't want to eat that every day. I'm not sure the spice they put in it. She put lemon in it, so that's going to affect the taste a little bit. Mm -hmm. But it has some... You do have that tart from the lemon, and there's a little bit of a... Maybe a slight bitter taste. It's not like, It doesn't have like a very deep flavor. It's not too bad. But... Um, I think the best thing of all this is the sliders, actually. And once you put that sauce on the hummus fries, they make them really good. All in all, I'm pretty happy with this. This is a fantastic experience, yeah. trying this different stuff. Definitely far different from what I usually have. So we're going to finish this, and then I'll give a final report. I'll show you the outside area more and where the bar is. All right. On to the next stuff. Well, guys, we did our duty. We just finished it. Now right, you want to give a final report? Want to give a final report on what you thought? Wait, wait. Oh, Ready? Wait. You talk first. Well, okay. We'll talk first. All in all, I liked it. <clears throat> some of it I really liked. Some of it wasn't. It all depends on your taste. But it was all high quality food. It was well cooked and everything. They can just depend on your taste, but this was a fantastic experience. I love trying different things. It's been forever since I had lamb, and most of the time when I had lamb, it was not good. This was actually pretty good. I never had 
lamb and a, ham a lamb hamburger. Basically, that's what it is. That's what a slider is. It's a tiny hamburger. Very nice. The sauce came with it. Was good. It was spicy. It definitely helped with those hummus fries. The hummus fries, I'm not a huge fan of, but when you put that sauce on it, it was a lot better. So hold on, this this is basically a general mint peppermint tea. I liked it. We also had regular. We had different alcohol drinks, like I mentioned, but I didn't get that. Well, oh yeah, I was pretty happy. Okay, now Ma wants to give her report on what she thought. Thank you. You said we for some sweet. Oh no, I don't think they make pretty No cold. dessert. Not at this time. Okay, sir. Thank you. Well, it was different. Those little grape things. Mm -hmm. I don't know what to tell you on that one. Um, they were different. Everything was basically cold, spicy. Even the kusan, kusan itself was spicy. Um, you thought that was spicy? Yeah. I didn't really think it. I thought the taste was kind of mellow. Well, for me, you know, and the sauce you dipped your stuff in, I took it and I dipped it in my hummus fries. They were good. I'm now going to eat my lemons. I eat lemons. But somehow they make me feel better. But it was different, no dessert. Oh. So you're pretty happy you pretty happy we came here? Yeah, I'm glad we came here because I, I wouldn't eat that food otherwise. And um it's different. Yeah, mom is a huge fan of hummus though. But I do like hummus, yes. She eats it a lot. I eat it a lot. And sometimes I fry it, I cook in spaghetti, I eat it plain, I eat it in salad. I love it. Now she just got plain water, but she got lots of lemon in hers. Yeah, I'm gonna eat that lemon. Okay, everybody, you gotta try for experience. Okay. Yeah. There's no fat on that food. cooler and it is a little bit but it's not too bad right here right now but I'm right by the door so it's a lot more louder out here and that's where you get the boat from all the way across the water you land right there and then you walk up here I wanted to show this it's very colorful inside Okay, I showed you what it looked like out there in the bar. It's actually pretty in that room with the bar, I think. I like that dark blue. Okay, a little walk around in this place. The maximum occupancy in here is 72, and then the outdoor seating, I think it was 92. Just to let you know. All right, say goodbye. Bye. And I'll show you outside a little bit what it looks like more out there. I just want to mention these chairs, they almost like they're hand carved. I think it looks pretty cool. Just want to show you a couple of views of it from out here before I go. This is the outdoor sea. I showed you from when I was in there. Down here is where you go to get the uh, transportation to the future world, Friendship Landing. I want to show you this spice rotale from this angle. Got a cool wheel. That's awesome. Yeah.